All right, there are sort of four major ways to classify angles, sort of four major groups of angles. They are the straight angle, straight angle, the acute angle, the obtuse angle, and the right angle. A straight angle is very, very straightforward. <clears throat> it's just 180 degrees. It's a straight line. A straight line is always 180 degrees from one side to the other, and we call that 180 degree angle a straight angle. So that one's pretty easy to remember. An acute angle um, the way I've heard other people remember this one is that acute angle is a little bitty angle, like little things are usually cute. So acute angle is a small angle like this one. It's a smaller angle. And technically it means it's less than 90 degrees. So if it's less than 90 degrees, it's a small or cute angle angle, so it's an acute angle. An obtuse angle is an angle that is bigger than that. It's a, oops, I don't know where that line came from. An obtuse angle is a line that is larger than 90 degrees, so maybe one that kind of goes off like this. This angle here would be greater than 90 degrees, so it would be a large angle. and an obtuse angle. Obtuse actually means like dull, not sharp, so that you can see where that, that term comes from. And then finally, a right angle is the one that you're I'm sure you're very familiar with, may or may not have called it a right angle before, but a right angle is one that is exactly 90 degrees, and it's usually marked with this little sort of box on the inside of the angle here, instead of a rounded corner like we usually do to identify other angles like these up here. If it's a right angle, we actually draw a little square box in that corner to say that it is actually exactly equal to 90 degrees. So you have 90 degree angles, you have 180 degree angles, and then you have small and large angles, right, straight, acute, obtuse. And those are the four major sort of categories of angles.